limit ourselves to one way traffic fair enough okay let's get going 200 students already in the class and i can see no one uh, oh i can't see even my, myself that's true all right uh, examples should begin with the person and not expect everyone else to comply right so i'll start my camera and i also expect some of you to be on screen and whom i uh, do I have the honor of hosting first? Absolutely no one. And yeah, that's okay. I know Sunday, you guys haven't even woken up properly. So we'll just say that it's going to be a one way traffic again. Ajki Taza Khabar Samashar me ye hai. We have one. Oh, that's Ravi Prakash Mishra and Shomodip Bhavik. Or, or just some of the bombing spectacles, nothing else is visible. Um, Aaj ki taza khabar ye hai ki Bharat ne 100 saal ke baad Olympics mein pehla shwan padak uplabdhi. Olympic mein. Olympic Games mein. Oh, Simran is there. Sadhana is back. And so is Sohini. So, Sohini? No, Sohini. Okay. I need my specs. Aritra is back and Akshat is back and Joesh is back. Wonderful to see you guys up on a Sunday morning. What did you have early this day? Coffee? Tea? Happiness? What did you drink? Pork chocolate, which is not yet open. Sadhana, kya mazak hai? What a osmosis process you have. Bas jari ke so good. <laughs> right. Prashita has, uh, oh, biscuits, yeah. Joesh has had biscuits and coffee and whatnot. All right, people, time for business. Uh, let me give you some uh, insights as to what is happening in the placement scenario. Yesterday, we placed a lot of your seniors in KPMG. Uh, what does KPMG stand for? I, I think it stands for happiness because it gave an offer letter. <laughs> and the profile of a digital trust assistant. Many of your seniors got a PPO with HRC. Uh, it has been a good day. Yesterday, I mean, the good news kept in coming until late night. So I, I expect a similar kind of a year for you in 2021. Some hits, some misses. Not everyone getting placed on the same day in the same month, which is perfectly fine. Because if I ask you to wait for one month and increase your package by one lakh, will you be okay with it or not? Like July, I will assure you, like, I will give you a job in July. Mein dega. Okay? But the package would be four lakhs. Then I'll say, if you wait till August, I'll raise it to five lakhs. How many of you say, sir, 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 or in the Zara, I will give you a job in बल्कि जून में 3 लाख दे दो ये भी सही है अच्छा एक काम करो मई में 2 लाख वाला पैकेज दे दो ये भी चलेगा एंड इन दैट अल्जेब्रिक रिग्रेशन मार्च में तो ऐसे ही आ जाओ तुम और कर भी लेते हो इंटर्नशिप फ्री में <laughs> और फिर बाद में पैसा मांगते हो उसका वी वांट पेड इंटर्नशिप ठीक है मिल जाएगा पैसा सो आई शो यू हाउ थिंग्स आर चेंजिंग द लाइट इज ऑन इट्स लाइक Delight, delight. This is such an atta in a stadium. Man, where say a delight and a perpetual cardio at the road get on other. Okay, so this is Deloitte's this year process.
तो लग रहा संडे के दिन क्यों बुलाया इसीलिए बुलाया ताकि तुम वो बीच वाला जो फर्स्ट वाला है वैसे प्लेसमेंट टॉप को क्लियर करने की जरूरत नहीं यू विल सर्वाइव इट members assistance we are not giving you help we are giving you assistance help is for those who cannot do it you can do it you just need a nudge a push from here and there and you can achieve it afterwards so we are there to do it for you on evenings and on sundays so aptitude test will be a test of your verbal ability quantitative analysis logical reasoning and maybe a little bit of tech maybe hmm. then comes the personal interview there can be two rounds there can be one technical and another behavior there can be just one round behavior and that can be such that in the behavioral they will ask you the technical question it can be such that in the technical round they can ask you behavioral question everything is possible just keep your options open right so this is the deloitte uh, uh, what do you say uh, process that they have sent yesterday 12th august is the aptitude test and uh, they will sit on it and then one day they will decide we will have to do the pi and they will conduct it khalas game over for them it's not a big deal it's for the students who are shivering and trembling like kya hoga deloitte jaan le 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 ki jaan to tum log jitna doge utna legi wo and if you sell up it's okay deloitte is just a company like hundreds and thousands of others ye bhi ho hi jayega then what deloitte did was that it gave a format for resume okay and it said this is how to create your resume humko aisa wala mangta screenshot screenshot ah are mil jayega ruko main dega tumko so it told exactly how your resume should be nothing too fancy nothing too complicated quite easy okay and uh, very simple categories like your uh, name contact photo then uh, resume introduction profile summary profile snapshot or career objective in your words not in the words of google mahashar highlighting your skills by putting up a skill set providing educational details positions of responsibility or certifications that you might have got but not like kya kya responsibility tha मैं ये था मैं वो था अरे था तो था किया क्या था बट हाइड यू डन सो योर अकम्पलिशमेंट एंड वॉट यू लर्न बाई डूंग तो नहीं बस ऐसे ही अच्छा लगता है सुनने में अच्छा लगता है <laughs> काम बताओ काम एन एस एस वॉलेंटियर बन के किया क्या सीखा क्या वट डिड यू अकम्पलिश नॉट अचीव अचीव इज अ बिग वर्ड अकम्पलिश एवरी वन कैन अकम्पलिश फॉर एग्जाम्पल वेन यू फिनिश दिस क्लास you will have accomplished a uh, a session in patience okay it will be uh, like you have completed one round of learning this is also accomplishment minor one but yet accomplishment okay then other languages known or uh, relevant interest and in hobbies these are optional even if you don't have any extra language all my jharkhand bihar friends hindi and english no problem it's optional extra languages are optional people living in khadakpur are now like hindi english bengali and uh, some odia also and also french german spanish and a little bit of you know slang language ha uh, sab aata hai are bhai that's a different game all together you are talking about that. It, it you don't get extra points for learning german or spanish in elementary just the basics kya aata hai un dost hai is patro se hum abhi ruk ek do teen ki baat baat kar sakte ho kya are you able to talk or not that's the important thing okay the site has expired no i want the download milega ki nahi milega ah i got it i'll send it to you theek hai uh you guys are group 5 Okay, let me send it to you so that those who don't like my uh, teaching of grammar can switch off, uh, not switch off, like mentally switch off, and they can go and watch that. Group five, group five, where are you? Ye raha group five, or ye raha tumhara Deloitte ka resume sample. Banana shuru kar lo, ha? Huh? Hey, where are you?
Okay, guys, give me a countdown. Three, two, one, zero. Should be here. All right, people. Can I send it to you after the session? Um, it got lost in the abacus sheets. Achha, 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 achha. Stop abacus sheets. There you go. Ashkaro. It's in your telegram right now. But uh, it is only for those people who are bored with my voice and my face and my uh, other stuff with regards to grammar. Because I'm starting the grammar part. This <laughs> resume will be able to show you when you will be written clear. If you don't written clear, how will it be? How will it be? So I'm going to give you today a very important session that is the foundation of a number of uh, error detection questions. Say hello to subject verb agreement. Those who know anything about it, raise your hand on the video. I know, I know. Raise your hand. Raise your hand. Shubham Divedi knows about it. He has raised his hand first. Oh, he was sleeping. Sorry, sorry. Wrong angle. Hmm. Or koi? Achha, Somrita Dutta knows that. Anushka Achari has raised his hand in DP. Mein hi Great. What? टैलेंट है मेरे क्लास में देखो लोग अपने डीपी में हाथ उठा ले रहे हैं वाह सो टेन पीपल नो दैट इलेवन फैजान एंड स्नेहिल आर्या ज्ञानती परिजा आरपीएम आरपीएम भाई क्या नाम है तेरा आरपीएम है तू रवि प्रकाश मिश्रा <laughs> अनुष्का शुभांकी ग्रेट इशिता अनिकेत अनवेश अक्षत देवाशीष पाड़ी All right, hands down. I know, I understand. You understood it. So, if you have done this work, you have understood it and you have known it, then unlearn it. Whatever you have learned, unlearn it. And then we are going to relearn it. This capacity to learn, unlearn and relearn, okay, is a very important one. It is L-U-R-E, lure. That is the attraction of the corporate sector. It will be fun. I hope so. प्लीज अनम्यूट अवर सेल्स कैसे यार <laughs> तो लोग कांड कर दोगे अनम्यूट करने से कल एक को अनम्यूट किया था वो शुरू हो गया एकदम ठीक है अनम्यूट कर रहा हूं गलत फायदा मत उठाना आई ट्रस्ट यू सो इन अ सब्जेक्ट वर्ब अग्रीमेंट देर आर टू पार्ट देर इज अब्जेक्ट एंड देर इज अर्ब लाइक इन एनी रिलेशनशिप देर आर टू पीपल and uh, complicated uh, kunjaban relationships there are three people in lockdown period there are four people right and it increases as you go as you complicate the things and you update your status on facebook it's complicated so at least there are two two people in a relationship similarly in subject verb agreement also there are two people there is a subject and there is a verb so the subject is the one that is the doer that does all the activities okay it is the doer the subject is always present sometimes visible sometimes invisible and i'm not even giving a gender to it because i don't do gender stereotyping okay i just observe whatever is there and if i see something being followed in mass well that's it so in our relationship there is a performing partner and there is a passive one how do i lower your hands lower your hands guys yeah usually the doer is a noun or the pronoun of that noun okay it can be a gender gender neutral it can be a gender specific pronoun but it is the doer what is a subject for example if i take this sentence the boys plays well the subject would be the doers who were playing playing is the done who were playing the boys is the subject okay uh, it is the one that gets talked about this is the one that you say that who 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 are like them 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 that is the target and it never changes it is there as it is for example 305 students are in my class right now this is a fact okay 
So what is the category? Students. Like that. 300 students. Will this change? Will this become student? Is it possible for me to make it student? No. Unless all of you leave. Except Aman Kumar there. Why bad jaga? Because he meeting on karke chhat pe chala gaya tha. Vyayam karne ke liye. Jab wapas aaya to dekha sab pe chala gaya. So only one person left. Only in that circumstance will I say student. Otherwise it's going to be students. So it is not going to change. What can change because of time, because of approach, because of situation is the verb. The boys plays well. Are, 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 kuch hai. Something is there. Something is wrong. What is wrong? What is wrong? And you see that in this equation, the power balance is upset. Okay. Ajeeb sa lag raha. Many of you who did not raise your hand when subject of agreement question was uh, popped to you. You knew there was something wrong in the sentence, just could not identify. Like if there was a question set containing 10 sentences, five of them were wrong, you will pick out the five wrong ones. But if I ask you, where are those five mistakes? Which part of the sentence? Then maybe there would be some issue for those who are not acquainted with subject verb agreement rules. Otherwise, you can do it. So it does not change. That is the one who is the strict one. The noun part, the subject part, the doer part. Who is changing? The verb part is always changed. Okay. And the verb changes to become anything that the noun demands to. Okay. It is the oxygen of the sentence. Without a verb, that cannot be a sentence. All the verbs are very required. And they are the ones that they... They bend, they crawl, they agree, they appease. They are the ones that accommodate, that adjust. They are the ones that adapt. They are the ones that become subservient to the doer. Okay. It's the slave and master relationship. But since slavery is over, we'll call it a boss and employee relationship. Similar, but sounds better. Okay. Don't be afraid of uh, employee boss thing because that is why you are in my class. You want to become employees. Kaun banna chata hai naukar? Hum, hum, hum. Ek second sir, naukar banna padega. A naukari karna hai to naukar banna padega. Simple hai. There is no other, no other euphemisms to this. Yeah. So true. It is, that's how it is. You have the verb which is doing the appeasement all the time. That is the one in the relationship when things go a bit bitter. Or even if they are not the bitter one, they are the first ones to call. Pahle call karenge. Babu, kya hua? Kahe gussai ho? Hum ka kare tumhar liye? Etc, etc. Until the other person agrees like, okay, koi baat nahi. Hmm. Ye wo dhe na, jo apne nursery se le kar ke ab tak jo hai na, mas mu pula kar ke baitte hai. Nain, tum, tumhari galti hai. You should say sorry. Why should? Oh, bring that book back. Bring it back. No, 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 no. It is not in a good shape. So they, these guys take my books and they read it and they don't know how to read books. Children of illiterate parents. Yeah, so this is how things are there in the subject verb relationship. They, oh my goodness, no one reminded me to start the recording. Agar class ke dauran koi so gaya aur baad mein uttha to usko dena padega. Recording in progress. Yeah. So in a subject verb relationship, the subject does not change. The noun and pronoun does not change. They are the fact. They are the reality. They are in the real world. But the verb that describes their action needs to change as per the passage of time and requirement of situation. So the verb should change. And the verb is very important. It's important and it should change. Like the Indian woman, the Indian wife, okay, or Asian wife, Indian woman such. Sensitivity is a lot of people. Indian people are Asian, Asian, okay? Asian wife. Asian wife's responsibility is what is it? Everything. Everything. You can imagine. Do the job, work outside, come back, do another job, shift number two, shift number three to take care of the relatives and all the friends, etc. Everything is Ventilator is going on, vaccine is going on, etc. Everything. It's basically the Asian wife. Okay. Sab karna padega. And who is the subject? I, I don't stereotype, but I observe as I told you. So the subject is the Asian.
कॉफ मैं ज्यादा जोर से नहीं चिल्ला सकता वरना मेरा कॉफी आ जाएगा कॉफी <coughs> अरे कुछ खाने को है जस्ट नाउ यू हैड लंच ये लंच और डिनर के बीच में कुछ नहीं हो सकता क्या अच्छा वो अब पकोड़े तले जाएंगे उसके बाद में फिर उसके साथ भी चाय बनेगा आई थिंक वेन द लॉकडाउन हैपन्स द मेल गेट्स लॉकडाउन इन द ड्रॉइंग रूम इन फ्रंट ऑफ द टीवी एंड द लेडी गेट्स लॉकडाउन इन द किचन यही है और कुछ नहीं A, a, any other boy who knows how to cook here can you please i mean expose yourself or like reveal yourself rpm knows how to cook ah ha ha girls take notice if your friends look for relation uh, i mean uh, rishtes in future just mention these classmates of yours theek hai bata dena hum aiso ke sath padhe the जो ऑमलेट और मैगी के अलावा भी ए, एक सेकंड ए विट विट कुकिंग डज नॉट इंक्लूड ऑमलेट एंड मैगी पुट योर हैंड्स डाउन इफ यू आर थिंकिंग इन दोज लाइंस दैट इज नॉट इंक्लूडेड नहीं अच्छा एक दो हाथ को डाउन कर दे रहे हैं थैंक यू फॉर बीइंग ट्रूथफुल अच्छा वैसे माइक्रोफोन अनम्यूट uh, है कर सकते हो बातचीत या सो दिस इज अगर किसी का मेल इनको हर्ट हो गया तो बात कर सकते हो लेट ऑफ द स्टीन शेयर योर दुख ज्ञानती कैसे भाई तुम अच्छा कैमरा के बगैर तुम जो ऑल राइट सो दिस इज द थिंग आई अप्रीशिएट ऑल योर बॉयज नोइंग टू कुक वेलकम टू द कुकिंग बॉयज क्लब एंड वी आर गोइंग टू बी एक्सिलेंट होम मेकर इनशाला and we are going to do a good uh, amount of load sharing of the home we'll also also wash clothes in the automatic washing machine and we will also do a lot of shopping from the for the home over amazon and jio mart we are going to be a very valuable partner in the in the couple creation that we are going to have. all right boys promise theek hai ye desh ke bag door tumhare haathon mein ये आज इसलिए बोलने की हिम्मत आ रही है कि मीरा भाई चानो लवलीना बोरगोहाई पी वी सिंधु ये सब मेडल जीतने के बाद में आज जरा से मुंह खुला है बोलने के लिए वरना कल तक तो गूगल्स तुम ही लेके आओ मेडल हमारे लिए नहीं नहीं है रवि दहिया है ठीक है बजरंग पुनिया है नो प्रॉब्लम नो प्रॉब्लम राइट सो नीरज अरे कैसे भूल सकते हैं भाई कल का खतरनाक एपिसोड हो गया yesterday before starting the 10 o'clock class i was a little bit late mero ko apna green screen wagera set up karna tha so i put on the white board uh, classes will start only when india wins gold <laughs> sham tak bachcha log telegram mein mera ekdam se khilli nikal diye sir go love yaar main kaun sa bola hum log gold nahi jeet sakte i said let me be that catalyst that main jab bolunga to us din jeet payenge to hua ki nahi hua batao batao aaj kisko jitana hai batao aaj aakhri din olympics ka jo karna hai aaj karna hai batao दूती चंद नहीं आने वाले दूती चंद नहीं है ही नहीं सर कोई नहीं है अरे किसी और कंट्री को भी जीतना सकते हैं इतने ज्यादा मतलब रेस्ट्रिक्टेड मत हो जाओ कौन सा कंट्री चाइना को जीता तेरी ऐसी कि तेजी चाइना का नाम तक नहीं लेगा तो मेरे क्लास बीटीएस दिया है हम लोग को हुई दिया है सैमसंग दिया चलेगा यूएसए सर यूएस यूएस जीता हुआ है भाई और यूएसए जीतेगा तो डेलॉइड जीतेगा डेलॉइड जीतेगा तो तेरी किस्मत चंपी यही सोच रहा है ना तू नहीं डेलॉइट इंडिया ऑफिस सर पाकिस्तान से हाँ पाकिस्तान को जिता देंगे भाई उसके बाद मेरी नौकरी रहेगी तो सोच रहे समझ रहे राइट वैसे ही शक के दायरे में तू और मेरी जिम्मेदारी अच्छा जापान को जीता है तो जापान से जीतेगा तो स्पुटनिक भी आ जाएगा वैक्सीन जापान ने स्पुटनिक नहीं बनाया भाई साहब वो जरा सिर्फ तेरा कॉम्पास टिक कर ले गाइस कैन यू गिव मी अ सेंटेंस दैट डज नॉट हैव अ वर्ब वर्ब लेस सेंटेंस कम ऑन थिंक ऑफ इट चैलेंज ओपन चैलेंज वर्ब लेस सेंटेंस चैट बॉक्स माय नेम इज सर माय नेम इज आदित्य नारायण समल हाय आदित्य माय नेम इज आदित्य नारायण समल इज is the verb <laughs> okay uh joyesh devnath has given let's go go kya hota hai is it a feeling ye good morning na hai happy birthday <laughs> happy birthday 
Okay, so there is no verb in happy birthday and happy birthday is not a sentence. Good morning. Okay, actually what is happening in good morning and happy birthday, these are first of all excla exclamations, okay, or expressions. These are not sentences. If you make them a sentence, then it is like, oh, we wish you a happy birthday. We wish you a, oh, that is, oh, Christmas. Huh? And a happy new year. So, oh, wish is the part that is silent there, but it is there. Okay. It's like that tamanna to become a film actor while you are trying to become an engineer. So, it is there, but it is hidden. It is suppressed. It will come out. Once you don't get placed for six months, around November, December, the actor will come out. Why don't I get a job? Why don't I get a job? Why don't I get a job? My father has put me in engineering. And then you, it, you become a natural actor by the sixth month of your fourth year. Uh, or maybe around this time next year, you always you already will be making TikTok videos in case TikTok gets unblocked. So there is a verb. And you can see in the middle part of this uh, slide that I have in front of you, it is written that, okay, you be, am, is, are, was, where. These are all verbs. They are the verbs Mostly they are the main verbs. Sometimes when there is an extra action involved, these become the additional verbs. Okay. Shalo. Next thing are the rules of subject verb agreement. What are the rules? There are 20 rules. I will not teach you all of them because I know that you have a very relaxed. What a wonderful world. I, I am surprised. I am surprised. I'm so happy to notice that what a wonderful world. So there are hidden words, bro. If you say it in, in isolation, it will not make sense. So there are rules that govern this relationship between the subject and the verb. If these rules are bent, breakup happens. And this breakup has no patch up of any kind. Breakup is breakup, full breakup. <clears throat> so first of all, the first rule is that they should agree in number. The agreement between subject and the verb should take place in number. How do you know number? Well, in English, you have S that shows whether something is plural or singular. In nouns, if S is there, it is singular. In verbs, when S is not there, that is plural. Okay. So dog, singular. But grouse, S is there. Though S is there, it is still singular. As I told you in the example just now, if the S is there, the noun is singular. And if the S is not there, the verb is plural. Okay? If S is there, it is plural. And S is not there, it is plural. So this is how. Basically, understand in the subject and verb, only one can take S. Any one of them can take S. Both of them cannot take. The dogs growls, galat. Play, boys plays, galat. Students studies, galat. Okay, there are some nouns that do not get pluralized with an S. So you have to be careful that now what should we do? So you'll have to check the status of that noun now. Is it plural without an S? Can you give me an example of a plural noun without an S? It does not get pluralized with an S. So fish, fish, mm -hmm. sheep, children, mm -hmm. sheep, child becoming children. Okay. You can use it. Luggage, baggage. Luggage and packages. Luggage. Good teeth. Achha. Crowd. Men. Head. Uh, the man to men. People. Man to men. People to people. People is a plural of. Ah, okay, okay. Hair. Hair. Ah, yeah. But you are basically giving me examples of guys, people, that you're giving me example of how nouns can become plural without changing the form. Hair, shape, fish. example there. Those who gave me the example of a word which is different from the singular form, child, children, man, men. So these are the ones I was looking for, where without adding an S, you still got a subject. So these are the words that you should be careful with. Because your mind will be missing out if it is not accustomed to it. So I'll get, get you to do some exercises, some practice questions so that you become, you are in sync with it. Okay. So basic funda number one, S can be present either in subject 
or in the verb, not in both. Okay. Okay. Then there is a situation called a subordinate clause. What is a subordinate clause? Subordinate clause added adds data to the subject. The dog. This is the subject. Okay. Karta over here. Gone. Kutta. Karta, dharta, kutta. Dog is the doer. But then dog has an identity. What is the identity? Which dog? Not any dog. That dog which was chewing on my jeans. Okay. When you respect the dog too much, you say who? If you don't want to respect it, then you will say which? Who is personification? You consider it a person. Then you call it who? If you don't want to give it the status of a person, you can just say which and that and it will be okay. The dog. Who is chewing on my jeans? Now there is the trick that the question setter is going to play on you. What? The question setter will say jeans and you'll say jeans. That's plural. Uh -huh. Plural. Lekin kya wo karta dharta hai? Jeans ne kuch kiya? Nahi. Usko kiya gaya. Usko kata gaya. Chabaya gaya. Kis ne kiya? Kutte ne. So now the dog. The dog is single. <coughs> Sorry. The dog is singular. Now, if the dog is singular, then the verb describing the dog's action, and that is, is, will also be singular. And hence it is. And if the person is bhavna, I mean, apologies to any girl who is called bhavna here. The, the dog who is chewing my on my jeans are usually good. Then this is how a person who has a short term memory, like just say, usne dog se hoop e gaya, oh dog ko bhool gaya. So jeans yaad tha, to usne R laga diya. This is the biggest mistake my students make while trying to answer subject verb agreement questions. Okay, are you clear about number one and number two? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Cool. So remember these things do not affect. Whatever is between the subject and the verb does not affect the agreement and the subjects and the verbs. Okay, I was not looking for yes, sirs. I was looking for no, sirs. Kisi ko samaj mein nahi aaya. Bindas bolo, you have paid the fees. I am at your service. Just say, sir, I didn't get number one, number two. I'll explain it to you. Again. No problem at all. I'm totally with you on this. Anyone? Shayak, your hand is up. Oh, oh sorry. It was from the previous question. No problem. No problem. I know you are a good guy. You don't smoke. All right. So we are done here. Let's go to some complicated rules now. What are complicated rules? Prepositional phrases. Now, prepositional phrases are a bit complicated. Reason? When prepositional phrases enter the discussion, they almost become the same as the previous problem. What is the previous problem? In the previous slide, I showed you that subordinate clauses were there who were messing up everything. Now it is the turn of the prepositional phrases. What is wrong with it? Why am I not able to make it red? What is the preposition in the sentence? The colors of the rainbow are beautiful. You know, preposition that shows you the position. Which one? Five, four, three, two, one. So sorry to note that a class of 328 people is not able to figure out one preposition. Art. Sir, off. Off. Off, sir, off. Thank you. Now, when you say off, then whatever comes after the off is actually the detail, the data, the extra. It's not a part of the doer, the colors of the rainbow which appeared on the first evening of Saturday in last month before the, the exam started. Extra information. Karta kon? Kiske baare mein baat ho rahi hai? The colors. Colors ke baare mein baat ho rahi hai. So identify the subject first and things will become explicitly easy for you. Rainbow is singular. Colors is plural. Don't get confused. Whatever is after the preposition is irrelevant. Whatever is between the commas is irrelevant. If it is not the doer, it does not have any power. Okay. 
so the colors colors is plural now whatever the plural uh, subject whatever the subject is that is going to uh, govern or rule the verb and that is how you end up with r okay whatever prepositional phrase is there between the subject and the verb usually it does not affect the agreement why have i written do not here i said does not but i read do not this is also a question for you anyone sabse pehle subject and verb is uh, no 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 be explicit which one are you talking about the prepositional phrases exactly prepositional phrases so if i say phrases then i'll say do not but i didn't say that i said preposition and hence i had to say does not be very clear about it practice i'll give you some practice for it but only after i'm done with this one so some care needs to be taken care, i mean isko yahan pe dal dete now it is okay you have to identify each part correctly subject kon hai verb kon hai so when you get there and here things like there and here here then you have to be careful like where are you talking about is there the subject are you talking about there as a subject yeah hmm? so there is a subject where you where it is a bit deferred how the position of the noun or the subject has been relegated there is a stop gap arrangement it's like the it's like the rumal that is there when you which you put on a train seat before occupying it aajkal to naubat nahi aa rahi you guys are at home staying home staying safe but when you used to travel especially boys who made last minute uh, decisions to bari theke beriye jabo ami ai ekhane thakbo na amar bariye jabar mon korche but there is no reservation what do you do you go to jan shatabdi aur khidki se rumal phek dete so you are throwing there and here until you come and occupy that seat so the problems and papers had to occupy the seat but they were there they, it was not possible for them to be there at that time so they put there and here is this concept clear about a dummy subject there and here it's bit difficult because it's not there in hindi odia bengali it is not there it is a english concept okay so those students of mine who so who speak after translating first of all they create a sentence in their mind then they translate each part of that sentence then they put it in the right place according to grammar learned through learn ren and martin or thompson and then they speak taking three times the time and increasing the danger by 100% of making a grammatical mistake that is when you realize it yes ronak गलती से आ गया क्या सो इफ यू आर डूइंग द ट्रांसलेशन मेथड इंग्लिश स्पीकिंग माय फ्रेंड्स यू आर ऑन ए रॉन्ग ट्रैक व्हाट शुड यू डू यू शुड डू थिंकिंग मेथड स्पीकिंग इंग्लिश ऑल दोस हु स्पीक इंग्लिश हु थिंक इन इंग्लिश फाइंड इट रियली इजी टू स्पीक इन इंग्लिश इट बिकम्स अ सबकॉन्शियस अफेयर यू विल मेक मिस्टेक्स अरे बाबा यू आर बोर्न हियर you are born in non english speaking community it is you are bound to make mistakes and it is totally fine because the people whom you look up to the native speakers of english they make mistakes every morning every evening every afternoon why should you be 100% perfect i hate perfection in humans because when you do that you are actually creating all those stereotypes that other people will judge you against aisa to nahi ho tum like every girl gets compared with fair and lovely model uska skin to kitna smooth hai wo isliye hai because she is you know polythene wrapped if it, she gets exposed to the same amount of smoke and dust and heat and germs like i do she will also develop sufficient amount of acne yeah please don't compare her with me and that's a sincere request to all the boys who in the year 2030 will be looking for spouses by comparing the shadi.com profile with the girl you meet in the cafe i mean in case you are still interested in the arranged marriage system in that year i i don't know what the social construct is going to look like in that year 
सो मे बी इट इज गोइंग टू बी दैट और मे बी इट इज गोइंग टू बी द नियरेस्ट कलीग हो शादी करना है नहीं ठीक है कोई बात and then just hunt for happiness in your office only ye bhi ho sakta chalo yeah these are the four rules i wanted to introduce to you today it's time for you to do some exercise my class is not going to be lecture mode <gasps> what happened i i don't believe this oh no sujata ma'am what have you done okay what has happened is basically i created a quiz what i created in a different meeting now sujata ma'am has sent you a totally different link and uh, resulting in i am uh, resulting in the situation that i am not able to give you this so what do i do i take you to the question section where you can just look at the questions and answer them meanwhile do you have any doubt in question number 3 or a uh, rule number 3 or 4 should i show you show it to you again recording stopped yes sir please okay here it is meanwhile let me go and find out that thing for you so number 3 once more number 3 certain sentences contain uh, some sort of a preposition in order to explain the meaning okay uh, for example the house if i want to show which house then i'll have to give the data the house on the right of the highway after the 55 mile post what are we talking about what are we talking about joish yes house. house no matter what i add after it in terms of position location direction movement or motion will not change the fact that we are talking about the house the house uh towards east after the ganne ka khet in the middle of the woods what are we talking about ganne ka khet woods east what are we talking about house you <laughs> are talking about the house so that is what the rule says doesn't matter what is the prepositional phrase how do you know what is the prepositional phrase whatever is there after the preposition adds up to the prepositional phrase it is like uh, whatever is inside the parlegi wrapper belongs to the parlegi uh, <laughs> brand ya jo bhi bol lo okay it is the it is what it should be there so the prepositional phrases have minimum impact certain exceptions are there i'll show it to you first of all absorb this data then i'll tell you the other part so prepositional phrases do not affect subordinate clauses what was subordinate clause same thing extra information i gave you the information that dog which was chewing on my jeans or which has a golden coat or which was vaccinated no dogs are not vaccinated okay uh, which was given an injection whatever you are giving extra data does not count the doer remains the same i hope it is clear okay yes sir in the second uh, fourth point which is the subject the balance sheet or problem because you have highlighted problem no look at the bold words that is the subject which one is bold on your screen problem problem that's it what am i getting mostly aha uh-huh. oh yes okay i have some questions for you but it's not exactly the one i wanted i will send the quiz to you and i hope i'll put it as a poll in the telegram group then you will be able to do it all right here is the question that we will try and solve in the class uh write a collection of your options for example in the chat box we can write it like this 1 a 2 b is tarah lik ek ek sath likhna tha i'm so sorry i entered the button pad gaya just keep it in your mind yeah when you are done you tell me and let me see if i can create some polls for you no 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 ashish don't put it here एक साथ डालो वन ए टू बी थ्री सी फोर डी इस तरह से पूरा कलेक्शन कर दो दाग दो एंड जस्ट डू अंटिल फाइव डोंट डू सिक्स सेवन शिफ्ट बटन डालने से तुम्हारा जो है ना नीचे आ सकते हो या फिर ओब्लिक मारते हुए जाओ वन ए ओब्लिक टू बी इस तरह से कर सकते हो और लास्ट में भेजना एक साथ पांच खत्म करके भेजना
So there is a mistake in point five. Is it like yes, Varun? It the should be spent. Spends, yes. Spent. Two. Sir, five is a very weird kind of a question. I mean, Varun very often spends his evening. Okay, means, sure. that's okay, okay, but with the answer, I mean, just the hand in coming to be a. Varun is a vampire. Angry. Don't you understand or what? Kya baat kar rahe ho? Itna saara movie dekh ke abhi tak creativity nahi nikla tumhe. Okay, it is spent, sir. It's not spent. All right, answers coming in. Thank you, thank you. Load it up. Papa, Papa. Hmm, beautiful. Titi love you. All right. What are the answers? Let us look. One of the soldiers, one of the soldiers among four soldiers. There is a mistake here already. It's a very complicated. And I'm so sorry to report to you. This is the case of the um, what do you call uh, materials. This is how the questions are sometimes said. No one sits and checks them. Just question bank of thousands of questions are there. and they just throw it at the students one of the whenever you say one of the immediately whatever is there after it will have to be something plural one of the soldiers among the four soldiers seem brave seems brave was seem brave is seems brave many of you have answered b which is seems because seems is singular one is singular they match hence your answer is correct katrina is exhausted after so many flop movies obviously anyone can get exhausted but katrina is exhausted she is running she has been running she had been running she was running now the rule that you need to remember in this sentence is that there are two parts of the sentence relating to the same person same situation the tense will be the same for both the cases so what is the first sentence it is is okay now second one will also become is though your heart will say nahi wo to daud rahi thi jiske wajah se exhausted do you have any information that she has stopped running no but you have the rule in front of you that both the parts of a sentence or both sentences belonging to the same situation should have the parallel should have the same tense and hence she is running sound sort but it's okay he has five now what sister in law sisters in law sister in laws sisters in laws oh my goodness so all of you have answered b and uh, which is a good sign no someone has answered d ye kya kar diya tumne bhandari hmm it is actually what are there what is more law or sisters sisters are there to fir sisters in law hoga when do you say in laws when you don't have anything in front of in laws just in laws like in law is sasural wala in law sasural wale but uh, when you say sisters to one s is sufficient you don't have to add another s sisters in law dash the end of tcs came okay had time for mathura and muzaffarnagar ye kya hua अच्छा देर इज ए मिसिंग प्रनाउन देर आई हैड टाइम आई होना चाहिए वहां पर ओके क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर ग्रेस मार्क्स वेन एवर देर इज अस्टेक इन द क्वेश्चन 
the agency has to give grace mark that testing agency the testing board has to give an extra mark to the students so you will get an extra point in number 4 with the end of tcs uh had i had time for mathura and muzaffarnagar along the end of moreover when the end of tcs came ah d is the answer for 4 when the end of tcs came i had a time for mathura and muzaffarnagar theek hai ek tcs mein tum naukri kar rahe the noida gurgaon ho gaya khatam wahan ka kya khatam ho gaya pata nahi tumhara internship ho sakta hai probation ho sakta hai tumhari naukri so you had time for mathura and muzaffarnagar varun very often spends his evening by hanging upside down from his home by spending upside down visiting upside coming upside down. i think as i said varun is a vampire so hanging is the best option coming upside down from his house like unless the house is on a higher place or it is something like that then it will be like uh, coming down otherwise the most likely answer is hanging bonus question number 6 many dash companies near magnolia dash cheap source of labor now what is magnolia uh magnolia can be a place magnolia can be a city it can be a township etc so many larger companies near magnolia all of them are comparisons either larger or smaller okay dash cheap source of labor okay now what is companies is it singular or plural it is singular is it is plural so when companies is plural the verb should also be plural the rule said you can have s in one of them either of them not both of them so now it has to be need where is need many large and now who will need cheap source of labor bigger companies or smaller companies it should be bigger companies so many larger companies near magnolia need cheap source of labor 6a 7 mr robinson was a dash romantic while his wife was quite the dash okay now hopeless romantic and quite the opposite that word is missing it is down below that okay ah oh, it is not there was quite the materialist what is the opposite of romantic materialist mythic cynic these don't apply to romantic okay the uh, if i take d i will match the second one was quite the cynic but i am not able to place depreciate next to romantic that is not getting adjusted for seven it has to be okay oh my goodness even was a bright romantic while his wife was we don't say bright romantic we say hopeless romantic that is the english expression but I, there is no such combination then i will have to go for the last one d depreciate romantic while his wife was quite the cynic okay now why did i take this this is a bad option but this is the best option among the bad options this is how english chalks out in your day in your day to day life so there it is boys and girls your uh, exercise for the day in subject verb agreement more i am putting up as uh, something in the in the telegram group uh, you will be able to solve them and get a feel of how you have done seven ones more which one seven Uh, mr rob robinson was a dash romantic we have to describe the kind of romantic while his wife was quite the dash so the right words should happen hopeless romantic and quite the opposite but they they are not there in the options what are my options either it is hopeless romantic a hopeless romantic quite the romantic then kya hua fir change nahi hua bright romantic was materialist materialist set ho gaya theek hai it is the opposite of romantic not exactly but somewhere there but bright romantic does not match then merry mercy romantic ye kya hota hai merry romantic hota to hota but mythic bhi then it's the same game it's not the answer i have already rejected a b c i have no other option but to choose d deprecate deprecate romantic means a person who has depreciated the value of his own life or things like that like reality depreciated the re- the value of reality hence romantic what is a romantic romantic is not a person who sends romantic love letters romantic is a person who is very much imaginative i i'm sorry i should have explained the 
the word romantic earlier romantic means a person who has a vivid imagination who has uh, who looks beyond what is visible and obvious and uh, cynic means doubting ye kaise wo kaise so they don't look beyond what is in front of them so the his wife was that and such a bad couple like uh, the guy would be like kar lenge aise bhi kya jaldi and the wife would like aaj karna hai mere ko ye hona hai zaruri hai bill bharna hi bharna hai apne ko ye kaam khatam karna hai khana banana hai such things like that all right we are done for the day boys and girls thank you for coming to the session and staying till the end i promise a very engrossing invigorating and enriching workshop next week on uh on uh, resume writing i've already sent you the document and i'm going to send some uh, samples also start preparing your cv so that next week when i do the workshop you will be able to relate to it okay thank you for coming have a nice day got to move to another class bye bye thank you, sir yeah start leaving thank you sir you're welcome thank, thank you sir, sir.